Hi everyone, my name is Jam Microsoft MVP. Today I want to share with you about response to and remedial security issue. You can tweet, you can find me at my Twitter if you got any topic about Microsoft technology. You can tweet me also and message me also. If you want to learn more about Azure security, you can go to the techconnect.io. Inside got a lot of hands-on about Azure security. Okay, this is for today's agenda. Only two topics. One is the investigate escalator security incident. The second one is analyze threat protection and manage actionable recommendation by using Azure Security Center. Okay, let's go for the first topic. The investigation features in Security Center allow you to trigger a potential security incident, understand its scope, and track down its root cause. The intent is to facilitate and facilitate, facilitate the investigation process by linking all entity, security alerts, user, computer, and incident that are involved with the incident you are investigating, Security Center does this by correlating relevant data with any involved entity and exposing the core relation in a live graph that help you navigate through the object and visualize or conceptualize the relevant information. A graph occupies the central set area of the investigation dashboard. The graph always focus on a specific entity and present the entities that are related to it. An entity can be a security alert, a user, a computer, or an incident. You can navigate from one entity to another by selecting the entity you want on the graph. The graph automatically centralizes that centralize the selected entity and its related entities. Entities that are no longer relevant might be removed from the graph. Okay. Let's just continue about the uh, uh, photo that you see. InfoTap. The InfoTap display information relevant the incident selected in the map. An incident in the in this context, it's a container that includes the result of an investigation. Every investigation happens to the context of an incident. An incident is created only when you are selected to start investigation for a specific alert. The basic capability of available is to mark entities such as user, computer, and alerts. When an entity is marked as rated, a reason is provided. From that point onward, the entity appears directly under the incident on the graph, and is and in the entity and in the incident entity list. Entity tab. The entity tab display all the related entities group by type. It is useful in two cases. There are too many ent entity assets to present on the graph and. When the entity's names are flawed and it's easier to examine them in a tabular way. Shirt tab. The shirt tab presents all the log type that are available in the entity. For each log type, the tab displays how many records are available. Selecting a log type takes you to shirt screen. On the shirt screen, you can refine your search and use the various shirt features such as setting alert in the current release. The shirt tab is availability only for user and computer entities. Exploration tab. They allow is allow you to examine data related to various issues about the entity. For example, when a machine is investigated, the exploration tab present a list of process that Executed on it. In some cases, the exploration that present data that might indicate a suspicious issue. You can examine the data on the tab or 
open it on the shared screen to examine last set of data to use a one shared option such as filtering exporting to Microsoft Excel. For the second topic, to analyze how well one is protected from various threats. A security score would be very helpful. With so many services offering security benefit, it's often hard to know which one, which, what step to take first to help secure and harder the workload. A just security score review your security recommendation and prioritize them for you, so you know. So you know which recommendation to perform it. This help you find the most serious security vulnerabilities so you can prioritize your investigation and just your score help you assess your workload security posture. And your security score correction. Security center mimics the word of a security analyst reviewing your security recommendation and applying a one algorithm to determine how to share its recommendation is Security Center constantly review your activity, active recommendation and calculate your secure score based on it. The score of a recommendation is derived from its severity and from security best practice that will affect your workload security the most. Security Center also provide you with an overall secure score. The overall secure score is an accumulation of all your recommendation scores. You can view your all your overall score score across your subscription or manage group depending on what you select. The score varies based on the selected subscription or and the active recommendation for the subscription. To check which recommendation impact your score score most, you can view the top three most impactful recommendation on the security center dashboard or you can short the recommendation on the recommendation list link by using secure score impact that's all for today you can find me at my twitter and for today blog you can uh, look for the dev.po slash soon about today uh, video if you still not yet uh, subscribe my youtube channel please subscribe share and give a like that's all for today thank you very much